Good morning from the Heraklion Airport. As you can tell, it is an absolute gong show here all around us. Uh, we're flying with Welling Airlines and we're going to be flying from Heraklion Crete all the way to Rome. We're going to do a review of our flight experience with Welling. As always, we're not partnered with Welling. Uh, we're not being paid by them. We didn't get the seats for free. We paid for these. It's just our unbiased opinion. Uh, comparing the different airlines we've flown all throughout the years and starting off with the Rackman Airport. It's chaos. It's bad. It's real bad. Brad just broke his phone as well, so we're currently on the hunt to try and fix his phone. You can see this airport is an absolute gong show. There's just like people everywhere, buying things everywhere. And most airports are busy, but this one's exceptionally busy. Thank you. Our flight is now boarding, so we're just heading down and we have to kind of run down this little gate area here. Bit of a gong show now again. But we're going to head down here and yeah you could because then we get priority boarding. So if you check your bag you get priority boarding. So right now they're splitting us off if we get priority boarding or not. We're checking our bag. So we're going to see if we can check one bag and get priority boarding for everyone or not. Life hacks with Katie the life hacker. She is checking this bag and now we're getting priority boarding so we're going to board first which is very nice, we didn't have to pay for it. Also didn't have to pay for the extra bag, which is awesome. On the bus we go, on the bus we go. We have arrived at our plane. Here is the plane. Beautiful thing. There is the cabin. And here's our row. So you can see the seats, they're quite a bit of decent little space. Nice clean cabin. The rows themselves are decent width. Um, it's a decent amount of space here for your feet. Not too bad. Lots of cabin bag space up top. See the difference in the spot right in front here. That's a space one, so there's a little more space compared to these ones back here, but very, very minor difference. So, Katie, how do you think the seats are so far? First impression, comfort wise. Lots of knee room, but they're really thin. They're very it's thin seats. It's the thinnest I've ever seen. So, Welling will be the equivalent of like a Ryanair, EasyJet. It's part of those like cheaper, inexpensive airlines that you can fly all around Europe. Uh, we use them a number of times for work, actually, and they're really good, actually. We, they are great to work with. 25 kilograms for the bag for us, which was awesome. So I mean, that's nice. really heavy for a normal bag, because usually it's like 20 or 23, especially at max in, uh, in Europe. Um, and the flight wasn't too, too expensive, it wasn't too bad. Not a lot of knee room. I'm six foot four, and my knees are right up against the seat. So this is a very tight seat for me. You can see Katie, she's five foot eight, and her knees are like maybe an inch at most away from the back. So it's pretty tight overall. And then Brad, I don't know, he's like five foot one or something. <laughs> <laughs> he has a decent amount of space, but like not a lot of arm room. Like I'm a wide human, but like I cut right into <laughs> Katie's this seat. Trip, I'm a wide human. <laughs> uh, just a note on the amenity: there are no, there's no entertainment system, there's no USB, there's no power or anything. So make sure your things are charged when you come. As you can see, there's no power down here, no entertainment, but a no frills, nice airline. There is no food included on the flight. You don't get water, you don't get any uh, snacks or anything, but you can buy. Uh, you have to have a credit card, they don't take cash, I believe, so keep that in mind. But um, there's lots of options and things you can buy. They're not too crazy expensive, it's sort of typical airline prices. Um, but you do not get any sort of beverages or snacks. Um, so very sort of bare bones, uh, nothing included, but a comfortable airline. Shuttle to get back to the terminal. All right, we just landed in Rome, so we just got down from our flight with Welling. And over all in all, final impression? Good. I think bare bones, but like we we're in a brand new airplane. Also, they removed the no smoking light with like a no tech light, so it was a super clean. But it was good. Serve like service was fine. It was just a yeah bare bones, easy flight. I think the seats actually for being so thin were not that uncomfortable. It would be a long haul, be really, really squishy, but I think it, yeah, it was fine. Fine for a cheap flight. If it's expensive, not worth it, but if it's cheap, it's good. Same opinion. 
Very good. Very clean. Yep. Relatively comfortable. Not a lot of like room. Friendly staff. No, from this no one? very, Cheaper very no frills, nice. but it's, it's true. Really right, nice. Mind you, know a lot of around the world we've had some pretty nice, pretty nice staff. In and, Euro, and in Europe too, we've had a mixed bus. But um, anyways, yeah. really, really good overall. Yeah, I would definitely fly them again. Again, if it's expensive, not worth it. But for a cheap inter-Europe new flight, it works great and yeah. it's comfortable. Yeah. So overall, pretty good experience. Our next video. We're gonna have a few hours in Rome. So four next video will be Mark, a four or five hour in Rome, quick, quick, compact okay. tour. Stay tuned, Rome's coming up next. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to subscribe up here. Check out our most recent other videos over here or subscribe to our other channel over here.